within physical therapy, I have um, been seeing um, patients um, for vestibular therapy, which um, can be very frustrating for patients because they have this dizziness that they are living with that is causing some of them can't even get to work, you know, can't drive, just having trouble walking around their house, you know, because of it. And being able to give them either an exercise or be able to give them, uh, be able to maneuver them um, to address that dizziness has been very rewarding because um, they can usually see fairly immediate changes in their dizziness and, and, and function. There's different causes of vertigo, of course, but sometimes um, vertigo can be addressed with physical therapy, especially if you've had um, some type of history of maybe an ear infection that um, has caused you um, to have some inner ear problems and therefore causing some dizziness. And we can address some of that vertigo with some exercises um, so that when you go, that you can do at home. And it's a slow process, but eventually it should help with the um, vertigo that you are experiencing with your daily activities. You will get what we call gaze stabilization exercises um, to work on focusing on something while you are doing head movement um, and then varying that up with moving a target and your, your head at the same time while you're focusing on an object um, and walking and rotating your head and nodding your head and sometimes just tossing a ball back and forth and uh, things like that to kind of stimulate um, and hopefully eventually decrease the symptom that you're having. Most of the time people will come back um, saying that I, you know, with the gaze stabilization exercises that they notice, imp you know, mild improvements um, actually within a week or two and then it just kind of gradually improve over time. But it can be a slow process, especially if it's taken along, you know, if you've had it for some time.